If your favorite NBA team has a ton of number one overall draft picks, that means they're either really lucky during the draft lottery, or they have a historically terrible franchise that had many seasons worth of tanking and losing. In this video, we're going to name the best NBA franchise from every number one overall draft pick total all the way from zero to six. As for what goes into choosing each choice, there are a number of factors from what did they do with the picks, how many rings the team has won, and their overall win record. Now since the 2022 number one overall pick hasn't been decided yet as of this upload, the best way to read about what might happen in this upcoming draft would be to read the Game Day's NBA Mock Draft for 2022, NBA first and second round pick predictions. You can do this by clicking that top link down below or heading down to thegameday.com. There are only six NBA teams that have never received the number one overall pick. These teams are the Denver Nuggets, Indiana Pacers, Memphis Grizzlies, Miami Heat, Oklahoma City Thunder, and Utah Jazz. Of these teams, the most successful franchise is easily the Miami Heat, as they have the most rings with a total of three so far. The only other team with an NBA championship on this list is technically the Thunder slash Seattle Supersonics, winning it all in 1979. My takeaways from these teams are two things. One. This is a star-driven league. More often than not, you need an elite franchise player to go all the way in the NBA. And two, Pat Riley is one of the greatest presidents of basketball operations the NBA has ever seen. What he was able to do for the Heat and what he's still doing for this team is quite amazing. There are only five teams so far with just one number one overall pick. These teams are the Boston Celtics, Dallas Mavericks, Charlotte Hornets, Toronto Raptors, and Phoenix Suns. This one is another easy choice and we're going with the Boston Celtics as they are pretty much NBA royalty with a total of 17 NBA banners hung up so far. The Celtics drafted Chuck Scher during the 1950 NBA Draft. Chuck Scher is not only the first pick of the 1950 NBA Draft, he's the first pick in NBA Draft history, as in the first pick overall all time. This was the first draft ever. Now many fans wanted the Celtics to draft Bob Cousy, but he was chosen by the Hawks, then forced his rights to be sold to the Chicago Stags. Luckily for Celtics fans, the Stags no longer existed, so the Celtics got the opportunity to pick Bob during the dispersal draft. As for Chuck Scher himself, he never actually played a game for the Celtics. Scher's rights were traded by the Celtics to the Fort Wayne Pistons for Bill Sharman, who had refused to sign with the Pistons. Chuck went on to win an NBA championship with the 1958 St. Louis Hawks. Rest in peace to Chuck Scher. Only five teams have two number one overall picks. These teams are the Timberwolves, Pelicans, Bulls, Nets, and Spurs. This is a super close call between the Bulls and the Spurs. The Bulls so far have one more ring than the Spurs at six rings versus the Spurs 5, but the Spurs have a better overall win percentage, the Spurs have a 61% win percentage, and the Bulls have a 51% win percentage. And then there's the number one picks themselves. The Spurs selected David Robinson and Tim Duncan with their picks, the Bulls selected Elton Brand and Derrick Rose. No disrespect to Elton Brand and D. Rose, but they are nowhere near the levels of Tim Duncan and David Robinson. But maybe if Rose was healthy, he could have been better, or on their level, but I can't make a choice based off of coulda, woulda, shoulda. I'm making my my choice based off of what is. As a franchise, the Bulls have seemed to have a ton of trouble building a new dynasty after grabbing Jordan with their third overall pick. The Spurs, however, seem to be really great at staying relevant and evolving and adapting to winning even if their franchise players get too old, retire, or leave, which is why the Spurs get my pick for this spot. There are four teams with three number one overall picks. These teams are the Lakers, Clippers, Pistons, and Hawks. This is an easy choice. It goes to the Lakers, no question. Their number one overall picks include Elgin Baylor, Magic Johnson, and James Worthy. There are six teams with four number one overall picks. These teams are the Bucks, 76ers, Warriors, Knicks, Blazers, and Magic. Who gets second is a super close call between these teams, but who gets first is easily the Warriors, as they have a total of seven NBA championship rings and counting. Their number one overall picks include Ernie Beck, Fred Hetzel, Joe Barry Carroll, and Joe Smith. Only two teams have five number one overall picks. These two teams are the Rockets and the Kings. We're flying to the moon on this one, as this choice clearly belongs to the franchise with two NBA rings so far being the Rockets. Their number one overall picks include Alvin Hayes, John Lucas, Ralph Sampson, Aguimala, Ajuan and Yao Ming. 
Only two teams have six number one overall picks so far, and these teams are the Washington Wizards and the Cleveland Cavaliers. The Cavs are infamous for drafting the worst number one overall pick in NBA history, which is Anthony Bennett, but let's not forget that the Wizards drafted one of the worst as well in Kwame Brown. So it's not like they didn't have their fair share of busts. Plus, the Cavs did draft a potential GOAT with their pick in LeBron James. Now that's not why I'm choosing Cleveland. I'm choosing Cleveland for three reasons. One, in less years of existing, they have a higher win percentage and an equal amount of rings. The Cavs are currently 52 years old, the Wizards are 61 years old. In this time frame, they both have one ring. And I think looking forward, the Cavs seem like they have a better chance at getting a second ring before the Wizards get their second ring, which is why the Cavs got my pick. Their number one picks include Austin Carr, Brad Doherty, LeBron James, Kyrie Irving, Anthony Bennett, and Andrew Wiggins. So here is the best NBA franchise from every number one draft pick total. Let me know what you think of this list and what you want to see in the future. Don't forget to dunk on that like button and subscribe with notifications turned on. I'm Rebound Rewind and I'll fast forward to you later.